Chapter 6, Worksheet 2, Question 1. So they ask you to draw the full electronic structure of magnesium fluoride. So in the periodic table, magnesium is a metal, fluoride comes from fluorine, which is a non-metal. Metals are on the left-hand side of the zigzag line, right-hand side are the non-metals. So since it's a metal and non-metal, it's an ionic bond, so we must draw ions. So magnesium has 12 electrons, looking at the periodic table, well, while fluorine has 9 electrons. So if you write down the electronic configuration, it will be 2.8.2. .2. So we will draw our magnesium using crosses for the electrons, top, bottom, left, right, 2.8.2. .2. While our fluorine, we will draw using dots, it will be 2.7. So since this is an ionic bond and we are drawing ions, the electrons will transfer from the metal to the non-metal. So one electron will go to join fluorine. How about the other electron? So the other electron from magnesium will need one more fluorine. So magnesium fluoride is made up of one magnesium ion and two fluoride ions since magnesium has to lose two electrons and fluorine only has space for one electron each. So I draw magnesium and fluorine including the brackets because now we have ions. So magnesium is in group 2, therefore it's 2 plus. Fluorine is in group 7, therefore it will be minus. So since we need two fluoride ions, we have to put a number two in front of the fluoride ion. Therefore, this is our dot and cross diagram with having the full electronic structure.